Hi everyone, welcome to Wig Studio One. My name is Christy, I'm with Wigging with Christy. Today I'm going to review for you Mesmerize by Raquel Welch. This is a new wig for 2021. This is in the color Rusty Auburn. And that color code is a pale red with warm blonde highlights. I just wanna thank Wig Studio One for sending me this wig to review for you. They sent this to me to provide the content for you for the video, but this is my own thoughts and opinions. So let's go ahead and dive into this review. So Mesmerize has that blowout look, long layers, kind of that effortless look of that model hair you all see in the catalog and you're like, oh, she just spent like two hours getting that blown out at the salon, right? That's the look that Mesmerize has. It's a very elegant look. It's a flattering look, I think, on all people and all face shapes. She's really gorgeous. I have her parted kind of in the middle here a little bit uh, when I unparted her for my review for my channel. She looks really beautiful. She has a fringe here, which I'll give those measurements to you when we do a spin, but I love longer fringes like this. It allows me to be able to style the wig in different styles I want, put it in updos, ponytails, whatnot. It looks really cute with that, I think. Um, it, the rest of the layers are really long. This is honestly like a cut I would probably personally have in my life. Uh, if I had bio hair is this would probably be a cut I would do with my natural hair. It's really pretty style. I love that. Uh, the color I really like, it's not too dynamic. It is kind of like a real soft auburn. Uh, but with the highlight being more of a warm blonde, so it's not like a copper or a caramel blonde. Um, it's just kind of a warmer, warmer blonde there. I like it. It's almost too caramel blonde, to be honest, but um, really pretty. Yeah, 27, yeah, probably is caramel. It is a heat-friendly fiber, so remember you just want to take care of it with a wide tooth comb. I use HD Detangler Spray from John Renault, simply Styling Spray. Um, they both work really good. You just want to make sure you hydrate these fibers and with remember with a heat friendly wig You're gonna to want to start from the bottom up um, And you just kind of want to watch how tangled the hair fibers get. So let's go ahead and do a spin Let's take a look at this rusty auburn color. So the color code again for this is RL3027. That 30 is a pale red and the 27 is a warm blonde highlight. Now inside her cap, she has the extended lace front, the sheer indulgence. She has the um, felt velvet ear taps with wefts going right here, which we'll talk about here in just a second. She also has the extended nape with wefts and the extended nape, velvet felt nape with uh, Velcro adjusters. Now, what I want to talk about this cap is it is hand tied. It's advertised as hand tied cap. However, it's only hand tied in this section here. Okay, right here, this top section, right here, here, and here. Down here, it gets into some wefts. Do you see that? and that is all wefted. There's no hand tied down there. It's wefts into the hand tied. Now I'm not sure, I'm trying to think 
If my Raquel Welch Elite um, editor's pick was hand tight all the way through, I would need to go back and watch that review. Um, but I find it really weird when wig companies um, are doing the hand tied, but then the bottom portion is wefts. Now I know typically wefts like in the ear tabs are for direction and placement um, of the hair fibers. The back though, maybe, I don't know if there's a reason for that, if it's the same reason for placement, but for me, it's just like, keep it all hand tied. But this is a real well done wig and it's very nice. Um, and I think it's part of a good, like standard, like cap for Raquel Walsh. I love Raquel Walsh's Memory Cap 3, you all know that. Um, and this is, this is nice too. It is tight on my head, a little tighter. I haven't taken out the adjusters, but just with this, like it is, it's tight um, for my head, but there is room to take out. So I would say this could go up to uh, 22 and a half circumference. But let's go ahead and put this back on. All right, let's go ahead and do some styling. This wig would look really nice. You could part it up here. You can do different parting and it's going to look really natural with that hand tied cap. I just went ahead and decided to keep this as a low pony. But I love these long fringe features for styling. So what do you guys think of this wig? It is really gorgeous. Uh, she is really pretty. My only hesitation about this. So if you know me, it's always going to be about the heat friendly fibers just because I'm so nervous. But oh man, so many of you guys love heat friendly fibers and Raquel Welch actually does a really good job with her heat friendly fibers. I would say they're probably like the best heat friendly fibers out there that I have personally had. Um, so I mean, they, she, it, it, it's done well. It's done really well. And I love this style. Um, so, and you can do things with it, you know, and restyle it too. And this, it's, it's a little bit, um, thicker fiber for he friendly, you know, like the Raquel Welch does really nicely with that. So, uh, don't forget down below is links how you can get this wig with wig studio one, uh, links how you can save money off this wig links to all of our social media accounts as well. I'm wigging with Christy. I'm on YouTube and on Instagram, and I'd love to have your support over on my channels. I do a variety of different videos, wig reviews, health journey, um, and some more other stuff on my channel. And I'd love to have your support from all of us at wig studio one. We hope you have a great day and a blessed week. Bye.